Hey guys and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a vlog. The hubby is home. It's Memorial Day weekend. So we have an extra day with the hubby. We're going to go to um, the local zoo down here in Chippewa. And we're going to give Miss Scarlet a chance to see all the animals. She's got her cute little outfit on. Her and her little red shoes. And her Mickey Mouse ears with her Mickey Mouse. Minnie Mouse. I keep on calling it Mickey Mouse today. I don't know why. Don't ask me why. But it's Minnie Mouse. Uh, so she's got her little Minnie Mouse outfit with her Minnie Mouse ears. The Boas from Box and Bows, which I absolutely adore that subscription. But anyway, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to actually walk down to the zoo because it's within walking distance. We're going to grab the stroller for her, put her in there, and then we are going to the zoo. She had her first burger today over at Culver's. It was so cute. She loved it. And then, of course, she had ice cream because, if y'all don't know, Culver's has an ice cream for the kiddos after they have their meal. And my cat's saying hello. Muffin. Say hello to the camera. It's like, what are we doing? So, anyways, the husband's getting ready. We're almost ready. I have all of her stuff packed because the kiddo gets ready first and then the parents get ready. <laughs> Um, so we'll be videoing and showing you guys what our local zoo looks like. It's a little smaller. It's nothing big or anything. We're hoping the petting zoo is open, but we're not quite sure if it's going to be open simply because of COVID. So stay tuned for that. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. If you're interested in this video, like, comment. Uh, let us know if there's anything that you would like us to adventure on next time because we're always looking for fun new adventures to go see. So let us know down in the comments down below. The husband is going to be on video. <laughs> I think he said that he's got to get ready so that way that he can avoid the camera time. But I'm going to make him be on the camera at some point today. So anyways, it'll be a fun little adventure. Are you ready, Scarlett? You in your red shoes? She's ready. Okay guys, so we just got to the park, or zoo. It's technically like a park with the zoo on it. Scala is ready to check out the animals. <sighs> a little bit of a walk. It's nice outside today, but hopefully the petting zoo will be open. We're kind of doubting it, but we're staying optimistic. So we'll see. We'll kind of show you guys what the park's like what it looks like inside. There's a couple of cool animals. There's like the um, lion and the bears, but uh, sometimes it changes. So we'll see exactly what is in the zoo today. Let's go.
Okay, so I'm finishing up the vlog. I figured that since I didn't take you guys into the store, um, I was a little nervous and so is my husband just because we aren't quite used to being on the camera and everything. So I didn't take you guys into the store, but I figured since um, finishing up the vlog, I wanted to be able to show you guys everything that I got from my shopping haul. Uh, we ended up going over the weekend, we went to uh, Wisco's, which is an amazing food restaurant. It's like a bar restaurant type of deal, but it's also family friendly. Uh, my daughter loves going there. And then we went to the zoo. We went to the little place called Osens here in Chippewa. Um, they have one in Eau Claire too, but we decided since we were in town, um, we'd just gotten done with the zoo, we'd just stop by the one here in town. Um, I know, I'm trying to like stay out or down because I have my new mic on and I'm not quite used to it. And it's kind of in the in the view and I haven't gotten the other tripod that I plan on using with that. Um, I do have my two new lights which seem to be amazing. Um, it's pretty awesome. And then I got a new computer for editing my videos and doing all of the content creating which I am so thankful for. Um, we went it at Best Buy. Uh, one of the guys that we know previous to all of this and stuff, um, he's a really great guy. He ended up quitting one place that we thought was a good place, um, and then he went to Best Buy. So it worked out for our favor. And then we went to Hobby Lobby, I went to Ulta um, to get a couple different things. I took back the IT Cosmetic Cream because it made me break out. I have really sensitive skin and I've been trying to find a, a full face brand per se to work with. Um, I did end up finding out that, because um, I took back the, I can't think of it right now. Ah, the Maybelline, I believe it was. I took back the full face stuff for that, and I want to update you guys that Walmart does do 30 day returns. So that makes me really happy. Anyways, um, I don't want to drag this on too long because I don't know exactly how long the full vlog is. We had a lot of fun and journey um, with going to the zoo in the park. I feel like I'm flailing. <laughs> um, I do have pants on. They are shorts. They're just matching the shirt. So, um, and I wanted to get comfy because we were doing kind of a little haul video as well at the end of the vlog. So, thank you guys so much for watching. It has been wonderful doing the first vlog. Next time I'm hoping to get out to the stores and do a vlog. I'm just I'm not quite used to that yet. So, um, we also went to Sally Beauty, which was amazing because I was able to get a couple different things. I'm I, my last video with the get ready with me was dyeing my hair. I have more of that whitening. Oh, that just happened. Oh, that hurt. So hurt. My nose is burned, so um, when I was younger, I had nosebleeds a lot. My nose is burned, so hopefully I won't have a nosebleed. But if so, uh, we'll have to kind of stop the video recording. Anyways, so I got the whitening cream from uh, Sally Beauty. It is by Ion. I'll show you guys that. Uh, I ended up getting a black for hair dye because that brown, I don't know if you guys can see, but it didn't really work the greatest. Um, so I got a jet black and that is that ion again. Um, I had it upside down. So I got a magenta and this is a nice like hot pink almost. I found a red finally. I've been wanting to get one. COVID has been just kind of awful. I'll start with Ulta first. So I've been talking about this Tarte Man Eater stuff. I got a travel size because I don't know if I really like it. It's 
you know, $24 for the full size. It was only like $12 for this. So I figured I'd get this, try it. If I like it, once it's out, I can get more. But I have a lot of mascaras right now, so I kind of wanted to um, not get another full size product that I may not finish before it's expired and gone bad. So anyways, and then I did in my last video um, the liquid highlighter and the liquid blush. So I got Clinique highlighter and this one is chubby stick and now I don't know oh hefty highlight and then this is the blush and that's by Clinique, Clinique 2 and this is the amped up apple so I'm gonna try those two see what I like um Ulta you can return things for 30 days so that's amazing I got a couple things from Walmart to try I tried to stick with um NYX so that way that I could see, oh, if maybe I could go with a cheaper drugstore. Um, so, this is e.l.f. I got that already. Um, I just wanted a refill, basically. And I got a bigger bottle this time. So, yay me. It was only like $7 for that. So, not bad. And I really do love, love that stuff. I've heard that it's been um, compared to MAC Cosmetic, which is amazing. And then, so I got this foundation, which I'm a little nervous because it seems really watery, and I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna like it. Um, so this is the NYX foundation that I got, uh, Total Control Pro. And then I got two of the concealers. So I got a light one for the under eye, kind of like as a replacement of Tarte. We'll see how we like that. I'm, I don't know. I really like Tarte. Whoop. And then I got a, like, all over our face. And this is also NYX. Um, can't stop, won't stop. The under eye is the alabaster. And then the full face is vanilla. So we'll see how we like those. Um, and then I also found in NYX, which really made me happy because that was the one company that I was trying to do a full face in. I found liquid blush and liquid highlighter in those. So the Clinique was $24 each. Uh, I definitely am going to have to love those in order to not return them, but it is Clinique, so I do have high hopes. But this stuff... Oh, is the NYX blush and it's Sweet Cheeks and Baby Doll is the color so we'll see how that looks and then I also found like I said the highlighter the liquid highlighter Born to Glow and this one is Sunbeam so we'll see how I like that and then I got three new brushes so I really like Eco Tool, and I also like Elf for a cheap brush. Um, these two brushes, I think I maybe paid two dollars each for. This one, I did pay ten dollars for. So we'll see. It's been a little while since I bought an Eco brush or Eco Tool brush, so we'll see how that goes. But that's that one. This is the e.l.f. foundation one. And then this is the primer for the e.l.f. For the under eyes and stuff like that. Or the concealer, I should say. Um, so I did get those. We'll see how those work. See if I like them. If not, Walmart has the 30-day return. Uh, if you put it on credit card, you don't have to have the receipt. If you pay with cash, you want to bring your receipt otherwise you get it on a gift card which isn't a really big deal for me because I am trying to find my best one and I'll end up spending the money there anyways because it's Wally World. Um, so I ended up also getting I have I do some destruction videos so I got some tools from hot this is from Hobby Lobby um, to do that and then I got a bunch of 
Uh, stuff to make into jewelry because I love jewelry but I'm allergic to almost everything it seems like um, so I'm gonna have to make my own jewelry to make this cute kind of stuff I could get it from Blissful Pharmacist they have really cute jewelry but I kind of like to match my stuff a little bit more um, so I decided to start making my own jewelry again which I've done already it's just been a, a couple of years so these are the little two charms for necklaces a whisker one and then a panda bear because my nickname as a child was Miranda Panda and I will just show you guys the matching sets and then I have these pretty gems and this is the last set okay so as I was showing the stuff that I got from Hobby Lobby unfortunately a lot of the stuff was missing little gems, whatnot. Uh, a little disappointing, but they have a return policy too. So, Mama's gonna take back those ones that are broken. So I didn't look them over. We were in a hurry because Skylar was there. She was getting fussy. I wanted to pick up some beads. So, it is my fault for not looking them over, but... They have a return policy, so that's not a big deal. I'll be returning those. <sighs> Hopefully I can either get replacements or maybe just stick with a couple. Maybe that was my karma for just going out and grabbing a bunch of different jewelry to make. So, anyways guys, I hope that you enjoyed the vlog, seeing my little family spend time together. And I hope you enjoyed the haul at the end of the vlog. And yeah, stay tuned for the next um, the next time that we go out on an adventure, which will hopefully be this coming weekend. It looks like it's going to be nice out again. And then, of course, I just updated my About Me section to give you kind of a schedule on when videos will be coming out and everything. I do plan on doing um, a video every five or five days of the week. We'll see how that goes. Things may change. Um, let me know down in the comments if you think that's too much, if you like that amount, if there's any videos that you would like me to do. Um, I'm going to wrap this up because I do have a lot of editing and I still want to get my true or false video in for this week done. So that's going to be another thing that I'm going to be doing. Like, subscribe to my channel, um, and comment down below if there's anything that you want to see, anything that you want to see change, or if you just have any questions for my little family. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day.